We're standing outside the break room now and we're looking across the hallway up near the top of the ceiling. You see another smoke detector. This one's a little different. It has a light integrated right into the center. So if there's a power failure or if there is an alarm because of smoke, the light will come on, helping people see where they're going. Because in that case, whether the power goes off or if there is a fire, sometimes there's a problem with reduced visibility. So the light will help. If we scan across, just to the right side, we see an emergency poster. Now this is an administrative control that helps teach and remind users, anybody who passes by, what they need to do in case of an emergency. We see these posted on the wall all over this facility, which is a wonderful thing. It just reminds people what they need to do. If you look down below the emergency poster, we see another fire extinguisher. Now this is different than the one we saw earlier. This is a class A fire extinguisher for just general combustibles. Now inside the break room we see yet another great example of an administrative control. This is a fire safety poster. It gives the users lots of little tips on how to keep safe with respect to fires. It's right above the stove and the microwave so it's at a handy place. Another control you would expect to find and sure enough there it is, the smoke detector. Now this smoke detector is a little different than the ones we saw in the rest of the facility. This is not hooked up to the AC network as the rest are. This is a standalone battery operated or battery powered smoke detector. Very similar to what you would find in a home. This is just a standalone. Continuing to scan over to the right we see the corporate first aid kit. This again is an environmental and life safety issue. In order to provide for the safety and the comfort of all employees this first aid kit is large enough and well stocked enough to be able to handle pretty much any minor emergency.